All right, so apologies for being super, super late for this video. Um, as you guys know, I usually drop these updates about 15 minutes after the news comes out, but honestly, I kind of forgot that part two was starting today, and by the time the news came out, I was already halfway to the gym, and uh, today's leg day. And as you guys know, I can't skip leg day, so um, I had to do what I had to do. But anyways, we're here now, and uh, part two, of the global thank you celebration has officially begun. So without further ado, let's check out exactly what's going on. So it says, Exploding Gratitude Dokkan Thank You Celebration Part 2 is on various events. Will become available. Don't forget to get Dokkan Thank You Celebration Gift Card 4 through the login bonus, the special missions, and the Purunga Dragon Ball campaign. Use the gift cards to recruit powerful SSR characters at the Baba Shop. And also don't miss out on other events including a new Extreme Z Battle and the new Extreme Challenge Campaign. Come join the events and enjoy Tokan Battle. Okay, so first things first, we have uh, some special missions, of course, pretty standard. And the second thing here is a bit of a surprise. Um, I don't think a lot of people saw this coming. I don't think anybody actually saw this coming because there was no precedent for it. Um, it kind of just came out of nowhere, and this was supposed to be Fizz LR Janemba, right? I'm pretty sure for JP, part 2 of their Tanabata celebration, or it was the Tanabata, right? Yeah, for their Tanabata celebration, part 2 was Janemba, unless I'm crazy, unless I'm forgetting something. I think it was LR Janemba, and instead, we're getting a random top legendary summon featuring Spirit Bomb Absorb Goku, and Super Saiyan 2 Angel Vegeta. And while these two are good LRs, don't get me wrong, they're good units, um, they're a little bit on the older side, and they're not new. That's the main, main issue, right? There's no new unit on this banner. And when we were expecting Janemba to get this is a little bit underwhelming, uh, very underwhelming in fact, so I'm a little bit confused. I'm a little bit confused. I'm not sure what's going on here. Um, but yeah, we got this top legendary summon. It's dropping in like four hours. Or less than that, actually. Like three hours from the time this video comes out. So, uh, I mean, obviously, I'm going to recommend a skip. Um, if you guys don't have either of these LRs, they are good units. Once again, don't get me wrong. They're good LRs. But I just don't really think it's worth summoning on this banner when we got some uh, much bigger fish. Bigger fish around the corner. That's a weird way to put it. But anyways, um, we got the Heroes collab. We got the uh, Super Vegeta. We got uh, even Kefla. You know, like a lot of good stuff around the corner. So definitely this banner I don't think is uh, worth your stones. Choice is ultimately yours. But if you... Uh, want my advice, then I would say completely skip it. Just don't touch this banner. It's weird and just not necessary, in my opinion. Okay, moving on. We have the Extreme Z Dokkan Festival for the Super Saiyan 3 Angel Goku, who is going to be getting an Extreme Z Awakening. We got the Majin Power Category Summon. Uh, obviously, skip that too. And then we have some Dragonstone sales uh, 32 stones, 2 times, 93 stones. Uh, four times, not too bad actually. In addition, you can buy uh, five stones at the price of one, once per day. Okay, um, that's decent. I'll probably buy that. And we all have, of course, the Elder Kai banner. We have the Extreme Z Battle Pack, and uh, new stages of Super Battle Road. This one is big. This one is big. So ten new stages. Um, I forgot the exact categories, but there's Revenge, Exploding Rage. Uh, there's a Bardock Team Bardock one. And uh, so on and so forth. I will be doing separate videos for each stage, so stay tuned for that. I'll probably do like two per day just to uh, maintain my sanity. So for the next five days or so, expect uh, you know videos for all ten stages. Okay. And uh, then we have let's see, a new Extreme Z battle, of course, for the uh, Tech Super Saiyan Three Angel Goku. So the final 120 lead is finally getting his uh, Extreme Z Awakening. That's starting tomorrow actually so expect a video for the extreme z battle event and also a quick showcase after that 
From there we have the new Tame Battle versus Super Janemba, super exciting. Love me some Tame Battle, best event in the game, as you guys are fully aware. And then we have the uh, Kid Buu and Buu Han, Extreme Z Battle events available every day. Uh, we have the Extreme Z area for uh, these guys, the Super Saiyan 3 Goku and also the Hercule and Buu available every day. We have a bunch of Dokkan events available daily as well, the Kid Buu event, Super Buu, Super Saiyan 3 Goku, uh, the Transforming Vegeta, the Majin Vegeta here, and also the Android 13, and a bunch of story events returning as well, uh, World Tournament Reborn, Fearsome Majin, Ultimate Final Battle, and Super Android 13. And that is essentially all there is to it guys so everything else is from part one uh it looks like quadruple exp is still on the four hour uh, reward boost is still on which is awesome and of course the uh, selection for your gift cards is still on if you guys need some help on deciding who to get with these uh thank you gift cards then feel free to go check out my video from i think last week sometime where i broke down uh you know the best units to get from each type but also just the overall best in my opinion that you guys can buy with these gift cards so go check out that video but uh, aside from that guys that is part two um not too bad not too bad you know aside from the banner which is really strange to me once again like it's really random uh the rest of the part two stuff is is solid right we got the um extreme z battle we got the uh super battery stages which should keep us occupied for quite some time and also the uh Explosive Chain Battle, which, uh, you know, it's not my favorite event, but I'll still do it. I'll do it for the rewards. It's solid for rewards, for sure. And, um, what else is there? Oh, the LR Great Saiyan Man 1 and 2, Extreme Z Awakening. I think that's coming out next week, right? Like 24th or something like that? Somewhere around that time. So, yeah, we also got that going on. And, um, that's pretty much it, guys. That is part two of the Thank You Celebration. I uh, hope you guys are excited for Super Battle Road, for Extreme Z Battle, all that stuff. Of course, like I said, videos coming soon for all those things, so uh, stay tuned for that. And as always, if you guys liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, oh, you know what, actually, we forgot to check out the, um, the missions. Let me just take a quick look at these missions here. So we have... Uh, the daily missions, no stones for daily missions, but for part two missions, let's see what we're looking at here. Okay, so one stone, two stones, that's three, four, five, six, seven, and thirteen. Okay, so thirteen stones for completing all the part two missions. Uh, not great. Could have been better, but I'll take it. I'll take it. Anyways, um, that's going to be the video now, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Like the damn video, sub to the channel if you're new, hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.